Hi, in this video I'm going to uh, introduce you to programming in a language called Logo with uh, a website called turtleacademy.com which is my favorite uh, Logo implementation. You can access turtleacademy.com on any type of computer as long as it's got one of the most recent browsers and uh, here's the Turtle Academy homepage and uh, first of all click on Playground and I'm going to show you a few of the basic uh, operations. Logo was developed in the 1960s and it was, it was originally used to move a mechanical turtle around the floor and the turtle had a pen attached to it and could draw as it moved. Uh, these days most implementations of Logo have a, a turtle on the screen, in this case it's a little green triangle. Yeah. The basic commands for moving the turtle around the screen are forward I'll type in forward 50, that's how far you want the turtle to move and you'll see the turtle move forwards. Um, you can also tell, it, tell him to turn right or left. So if I say right 90, if I type right 90, he turns right 90 degrees and I can move him forwards again and uh, he moves forwards 50 points again. If I want to clear the screen, I can type clear screen. And there are also short versions of the commands, so you can just type FD50. That moves forwards. You can write t uh, type RT90 for right, LT90 for left, um, BK. 70, that moves him back 70 points, and CS to clear the screen. So you can also type the commands in a sequence. Now this is the first important um, feature of pretty much any programming language. You can do a sequence of commands, a sequence of instructions for the computer to, the, and the computer will carry them out one after the other. So if I write FD, type FD50, RT90, FD50, RT90, FD50, RT90, FD50, RT90, and press enter, you'll see that the turtle draws a square. But it's quite a long-winded way of drawing a square. Um, so the next thing that the um, logo turtle can do, now the second thing I'd like to show you is how to do a loop of commands. Now in logo, if I want to draw four lines and turn four right angles, I can simply type repeat four square brackets forwards 50 right 90. I'll, actually I'll make that, uh, we've got the original squares so still there so I'll write that, I'll make that forward 100 right 90 press enter and the turtle just drew a larger square with 100 points, uh, 100 points in size. So um, that's much shorter than the long-winded sequence of commands. So it's worth remembering the power of loops. Now the next thing that um, I'd like to show you is how to create a function. This makes drawing doing, doing repeated tasks much simpler. Still, so um, to make a function you can type something like to square repeat four bracket square brackets forwards this time I'll make the square 150 points on each side right 90 close brackets and then you need to type end at the end of the function, press enter, nothing happens. And the reason nothing happens is that we have to now tell the tur give the turtle the command square. So if I type square, it draws an even larger square. Now to show you how powerful this is, if I clear the screen and tell the turtle to repeat 36 times, square and then turn right 10 degrees 
That needs to be in square brackets. Now, what do you think is going to happen? Watch this. There we go. So 36 squares, each one drawn 10 degrees away from the previous one. It makes a, a nice pattern on the screen. And you can see immediately how, how powerful this uh, combination of uh, loops and functions is. Once you've taught Logo how to do one thing, you can do it many, many times effort effortlessly. So those are three very important basic features of um, that, that you might use with any programming language in Logo. The sequence of commands, the loop, and the function. And um, just with those, uh, a knowledge of those three things, you can start doing quite clever and powerful things. Uh, now, if you'd like to learn more about Logo, you can go to the Turtle Academy homepage um, have a good look at what they offer and uh, at the top there you'll see that there are lessons and I certainly recommend going through the Turtle Academy lessons they're lots of fun and you'll learn, you'll learn an awful lot about programming in, in Logo it will give you really good basic knowledge for then going on to program in different languages and from um, from Logo we tend to then move on to uh, uh, program called Scratch which you will see more about in future videos. So have fun with Logo. Thanks.